you know, when you're playing one of these early access games and, you know, you're running out of content and then boom, update. How you like me now? I just imagine the devs like wearing sunglasses with a blunt in their mouth and like dropping an update. How you like me now, KJ48? What's up, my stranded friends? This is KJ48 and welcome back to my Let's Play for Bermuda Lost Survival. All right, guys, I'm going to read to you my little intro here uh, before I looked in, uh, into the update today. First of all, I didn't know there was an update today. So I wrote an intro. I'm going to do this intro a little bit differently um, because I think it's pretty funny. All right, so my intro was, we have done all we can do except for build and get food. Let me know if I'm wrong. Today, we're going to hunt for food and we're going to build, we're going to start building a base. All right. Then I looked into it and I saw version update one. Okay. We have an update, guys. All right. Pretty freaking sweet update. I'm going to read it to you. We now have more things to do. This Let's Play was on its last legs, man. I didn't have much to do. I was even considering doing a third video, but now we have some more content, so that is just awesome. All right, so the update. Increased playable area with more resource spots and points of interest. Does that sound interesting? Well, check it out. We got a whole other area right here, so you got a whole line of areas. I'm still going to build my base here, but we're going to check out this area today um, and see what's so new about it. Uh, placing buoys, or buoys, buoys, buoys. Damn it, now I'm going to have a problem with that word. Um, anyway, placing bowies. Uh, let me know if I'm saying that wrong. I probably am. Uh, now sets up renameable position markers on your map. So, as a matter of fact, I think we're going to do that right now. Okay. Okay. I just went ahead and looked it up. Uh, the U.S. Ver There's actually two versions, uh, two ways to pronounce it. Uh, the U.S. version is buoy, and the non-U.S. version is boy. So, I'm from the U.S. I'm going to call it buoy. Sorry, non-U.S. people, but... That's the way it goes. Okay, so let's go ahead and make the buoy. All right, so that's right here. Okay, what do we need? We need some planks, some ropes, some sticks. I think the first thing we need to do is get this. By the way, there's more stuff to the update. Just hang in there. We'll get to it. Let's. Uh, we got to start making some more rope. Uh, I got some rope hanging around here. Uh, there we go. Let's take everything out of there. By the way, I did fill up on items uh, at the bottom of the uh, ocean uh, while I was farming off camera. I did I did a pretty decent amount of farming off camera. And when you fill up with items, you sink to the bottom and you can't move until you destroy things. I almost drowned. So that was pretty, uh, pretty interesting. <laughs> All right. So let's go ahead and put, we're going to put a buoy down here so we can get back here easier because I kind of had to look around, uh, to find this area. So let's go ahead and put a buoy down here. Uh, nope, nope, nope. Get back in the freaking thing, you dumbass. There you go. All right. So. All right, there we go. Rotate. That's fine. And there's our buoy. Cool. So it's now on the map. Can we, uh, there might be a way to name it or something. I'm not really sure how to. Uh, do we have to go on it to name it? No. I'm going to try to name it. Deconstruct. No, I don't want to deconstruct. All right. Uh, do you get anything back for deconstructing things? Um, you might. I might actually deconstruct this, th this area at some point. But the fact of the matter is I need... A couple things on here, so I'm not going to deconstruct it just yet. What I'm going to do, actually, is I'm going to eat and drink. I'm going to eat and drink with some of my rations. All right. So what we need to do is wait for that rope. And while we're waiting for the rope, I will uh, go through some more of the updates. The knife, the axe, and the spear can now be upgraded to be more effective. That's what we're going to do today. We're going to upgrade the axe, the knife, and the spear. And after that, we're going to check out the new area. Um, the wooden raft uh, has been updated with some light sources. You can see right here, there's little glow sticks on there. All right. Uh, the character visual, visual, visualization can now be changed to female, and the game now supports key bindings for changing tools uh, or scrolling in the build menu. Um, changes slash balances. Chests can now be harvested for sticks using the knife. Harvesting speed is increased by 15% for all tools and grabbing resources. Rebalance spawn time for resources. Thirst strain has been reduced. Player level has been temporarily set to level 10, required for tool unlocks. And then there's some fixes. You guys, you guys can go to the Steam page and check out um, the fixes if you like. Uh, I'm not really interested in those that much. Um, so yeah, that's the update, guys. Pretty cool update. Pretty freaking cool update. Let's go ahead and make ourselves a spear. <clears throat> there we go. And what are we missing? Uh, stone. Oh, we need stone. Okay. I don't think I have any stone up here. As a matter of fact, I'm, I'm pretty sure I don't. I only grabbed stone when I needed it. So uh, yeah, let me go get some stone. So if you're interested in seeing the harvests, uh, including the grabbing, it's been uh, it's been made 15% quicker. I mean, it's not much, but it's something. I can feel it, you know? Uh, so that's pretty cool. I'm going to also grab some more seaweed bomb down here because we're going to need a lot 
of rope for stuff. Seaweed is the one thing that you have to actually make, you know? Anything, anytime you're down here for anything, any kind of wood, any kind of planks, any kind of whatever, uh, you you harvest it and then you have it. The seaweed, you actually have to wait for it to, to dry on your drying rack to make the rope. Okay, so that is just about it down here. This thing's already been harvested. Um, is that enough rocks? It's not a lot of stone, uh, but I'll come down and get more later if I need to. Let's get up here. Let's make ourselves a spear. I want to show you guys some fishing while I'm waiting for the uh, the seaweed to turn into ropes. Then we'll upgrade all our tools, and then we'll go check out the new area. I think that'll work out pretty well, pretty well. All right, so let's do this. Okay. Wow, that's not even a lot of ropes, man. All right, well, that's uh, interesting. Okay, so let's go ahead and make the spear unlock. We now have the spear, and uh, I'm going to go spear fishing. So now you just, you know, this is pretty self-explanatory. You just have to go near these fish and try and spear one. It's not easy, but it's definitely doable. I mean, you're pretty slow and kind of lame. Um, but I think we can get some. And I guess the schools of fish are the only fish that I see. So those are the ones you have to go for. I don't think the sharks attack just yet. So, all right, here they go. Oh, there we go. How do I bring him? Okay, so you see him. Now he died, and I should be able to grab him. There we go. I wonder if uh, spearing the fish with all the blood in the water uh, attracts the sharks. Come on. No? There we go. So you can see he's kind of flailing, 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 dying. And then once he dies, you can grab him. And I can almost guarantee you guys that, uh, yep, it's bringing the sharks. Now, the sharks don't attack yet, so it's not a problem. But this is going to be a little bit of an issue um, when sharks eventually attack you. There we go. We'll grab two more while we're down here. All right, you're dead. And then I'll show you some of the harvesting as well. Yeah, come on. Come on, come on, come on. There we go. It seems like I can get them when they're a little bit farther away than they were before. This is this is the most uh, realistic fishing I've seen in the game so far. This is pretty cool. Although the fish are a lot slower than they would be in real life. But, you know, other than that... Oh, come on. Oh, no. Oh, oh. oh you stupid fish. Ah, gotcha. Sucker. How many is that? That's five, right? All right, let me show you some of the harvesting. Uh, there's a boat right there I think I can harvest. So we're going to go ahead and... Um, I don't know if the harvest sticks or... Let's harvest some planks. I'm going to use the planks to uh, to cook me up some water. Oh, oh, hold on. I got issues with my oxygen. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Swim faster, you fool. All right. Let's go ahead and use this. All right, we got our oxygen back. Let me show you some of the harvesting. We're going to start cooking up some water. And uh, I think I'm going to put down the food thing for my uh, for my fish here. I wasn't going to the barbecue pit. I was going to put it down at the new base. Nah, you know what? I'm going to put it down at the new base. The hell with it. You guys won't have to sit through it. Okay, there we go. All right, so let's upgrade this axe and see what the difference is. Because I'm really curious. Do I have everything I need to upgrade it? Uh, no, I don't. Wait, I have the scrap metal. I don't have the sticks. Uh, and I don't have the rope. Okay, we don't have enough. That's okay. We have it up top. We just don't have it down here. All right, we're going to need some more sticks. Because this thing's going to take a lot of sticks. All right, so you can see. 15% faster. Pretty noticeable, right? Okay, guys. I did some more farming. I need a lot of rope. You know, I was considering... I was going to do... I was going to upgrade the axe first. But you know what? We need rope. And I get rope with the knife. So maybe we should upgrade the knife first. That might be the way to go because, man, you need a lot of seaweed for rope. Whoa, boy. All right, so I don't know if I'm going to get more more seaweed per attack. I don't really know what the upgrade means, but we're going to upgrade the knife. All right, so that's a little bit better of a knife there. We can't upgrade it again. So uh, let's go get some seaweed really quickly, and then I'm going to pass the knight, and we're probably going to we're gonna upgrade whatever we can, and then we're going to go to the new area and check it out. I think next episode is going to be me starting my base, though. Uh, so let's see. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Upgrading the knife. Oh, okay. So there's still only, yeah. You don't get any more. You don't get any more seaweed per plant. You just harvest it quicker. Which, you know, it's still pretty good. I was hoping I would get more seaweed per plant, though. Eh, it's pretty interesting. Yeah, I would definitely upgrade the knife first, though, guys. I mean, honestly, like I've got a lot of wood, but seaweed and and rope is a real issue. Uh, so that's you know personally, that's the first thing I would upgrade. Uh, you know, in a new playthrough when I have to restart, that's what I'll definitely do. So there you go. I don't know how many, how many seaweed does it take for a rope. I didn't even look. I know it's like at least three or four. <laughs> I know it's not two. So it's probably three or four. 
All right, guys, let me go get some shut eye past the night, uh, and then we're gonna go explore the new area. All right, guys, here we come up on the new area. New area hype! All right, this is gonna be freaking fantastic. Oh my goodness, I'm so glad they added a new area, man. Like, I I'm gonna give props to these devs. You know, when you're playing one of these early access games and you know you're running out of content, and then boom, update. How you like me now? I just imagine the devs like wearing sunglasses with a blunt in their mouth and like dropping an update. How you like me now, KJ48? Content, content for days. All right, so let's get it down here. Let's explore this area. Um, unfortunately, I am out of food and, and water, and I'm not looking too good on that stuff. So we're not going to be able to uh, explore here for a, a long time. But we will do some exploring. That looks like something new right there. Is that my raft in the sunlight? Yeah, that is a shadow of my raft. Okay, so that is not something new. All right, well there you go. All right, a lot of a lot of sharks down here. I'm not seeing anything new. Just a bunch of boats and. I don't know. We will explore this uh, more in depth next time I play. For show, sure. I guarantee you. I guarantee you. Um, but for now, we really have to get something set up for food and drink, because um, we're gonna die. You know, we're gonna die. We're gonna die of of um, dehydration and all that good stuff. All right. Got anything down here? Hello. Nothing. Nothing new. I like the new areas, but um, I would like to see some new stuff in them. Um, although, to be fair, I've barely looked around here. I will admit that. Also, some kind of underwater light source would be nice if there isn't already one. I don't think there is one, but I could be wrong. Ooh, sharky. Sharky, sharky. Shark shadow. Oh, look at this. This is a downed, this is a downed raft. Look at this. Someone else was here and the, the raft went down. Oh, man. Poor guys. I'm not going to harvest anything because that's not what this is about. This is only about exploration. You can now get sticks from these chests. That was one of the big updates, so or part of the update. I'm really happy about that, too. I was surprised you couldn't get them when I first tried. So I am not seeing anything interesting here. Guys, I'm going to perish of dehydration. I need to get something going at my base. I need to get some water, uh, some water purification um, goodness going on. So I'm sorry I can't. Um, explore this more honestly i don't think there's anything new here but i will definitely come back here next episode and explore it more but for now you know we're gonna get back there we're gonna actually start the base um i'm not gonna name the episode starting the base because basically the only thing it's starting the base is going to entail is me putting down a couple platforms and getting something to cook and drink i would like the ability to move our stuff you know maybe not pick it up but move it like if i put down a water filtration thingy whatever it's called um water distiller uh, I don't want to be able to pick it up and put it in my inventory again because I can understand why that's unrealistic. But I think we should be able to move it within our base. Like, pick it up and move it just like you wouldn't, you know, in real life. Um, I think that needs to be a thing. Uh, so that would be awesome. Because right now I'm going to put something down. It's going to be in a bad spot. I'm going to have to just rebuild it again later. And that kind of sucks. Although, to be fair, I've not taken anything apart. I've not taken anything apart yet. So I do not know how much stuff you get back from taking things apart. So that's something. Um, we also need to make another buoy for this uh, area out here. Did I? I made a platform out here, didn't I? Great. So I'm going to have to find this platform. This is going to be a freaking nightmare. Oh, man. Trying to find this platform out here. Uh, another thing that I would like is, um, can you raise the sail on the raft or something? Because I, I can't see where I'm going. I mean, right? I, like, I simply cannot see where I'm going. And that is really, really irritating. Uh, oh, wow. I see my thing from here. That's good. But you could see, like, if my thing was right there, I wouldn't be able to see it because the stupid uh, sail would be in the way. Stupid sail. Get out of my way, freaking sail. I hate you. All right, I don't hate you. You're, sail, you are awesome. You are getting me to where I need to go, and I love you for it. But, but, and there's a caveat here. You're in my way, all right? So you need to go somewhere else on the raft. I don't know where, but whatever. Okay, so now we need to uh, go ahead and start working here. All right, so what do we need here? We need to come in here and... All right, let's make some platforms. Should we just make two platforms? No, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be careful what I make because I don't want to lose resources on stuff that I don't need when I need other things more importantly. Um, so that's all I need from here. So let's go ahead and put the platform down. I really, really appreciate the extra uh, speed in harvesting. It's been uh, really nice. So it allows us to get some stuff done because I thought this game was way too slow. Way too slow. All right, so let's go ahead and put this down right there, and that is perfect. Looks good. Looking good. Okay, so now what we're going to do is we're going to come in here and grab all of these resources. Now, did this food go bad? Uh, 
This is food. Can be cooked. Oh, you can eat the fish raw. It's cool. I, I actually like that. I didn't think about that, but of course you can. Oh, um, look at it. I'm, I'm over. Uh, ext I got too much stuff on me. I can't move. Okay. Okay. Yeah, that's the water is what really makes you heavy. Well, actually, the iron. Oh, yeah, the iron. The iron's heavy. All right. Well, we need, the, we need that. Let's drop that and that and that and that and that. There we go. Uh, what was I saying? Oh, yeah. Being able to eat raw fish. Yeah. I mean, it's completely 100% legit. I'm really happy that they did that. Oh, you can make a bed. Oh, you can make a bed. Better than sleeping with the fishes. Awesome. Well, I don't have any room for a bed yet, so I'm not going to make it. Um, what I need is the water distillery, and I'm going to need the iron for that. So let's come on over here and get the water distillery iron stuff. Yeah, water distillery is number one. Uh, and we already have a barbecue bucket, so whatevs. There you go. Water distillery! Yeah, yeah, yeah! All right, let's get the, let's get the water, uh, the, what is it called, barbecue bucket, and put that down and put the water distillery down. And uh, then we'll be, uh, you know, we're, get, we're getting something done here, man. We're getting, uh, we're getting stuff done. That is fine by me. Okay, looking good. And let me grab the distillery. Okay, so we're getting a lot done. I was, I thought I was really in trouble with this, uh, you know, not having stuff, but no, this is okay. All right, all right, yes, 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 yes. All right, so we're gonna take some of this. Uh, I don't want to take all of that. Let's split this. Uh, twenty-three. Let's just take twenty. Actually, let's take ten. Let's take ten planks and see what we get from it in the water distiller. I'm really curious about that. All right. I think it tells you, right? That's what, it tells you how many you're going to get. I'm pretty sure. I don't know why I haven't paid attention to that. Ten. All right, I should get 20. No, see, I'm not going to get 20 from that. I don't know what that number is, but I'm, I'm almost positive I'm not getting 20 water from that. So let's see how many we get from 10. All right, we need to grab the fish as well. We need to cook us up some fish. There we go. And uh, then we're going to grab some more wood. Let's uh, let's grab five for the fish. Now nah, let's grab ten. Let's grab ten. You know, you do it. Put ten in both. That way, it's easy. I I know I had ten in both. Just makes it easy to remember everything. All right, fish and that run. Oh, look at the fish. Cool. All right, we are having problems with water here. We've already got a clean water. Wow. Talk about just in time, right? Heartbeat. Thump thump. Thump thump. Thump thump. Oh, your water's done. Did not, oh, look at that. That's so cool. Look at the way the fish are getting cooked. It's awesome. But wouldn't these sticks right here... Those are metal sticks, aren't they? Yeah, they're, they're metal spikes, I think. Otherwise, if they were real sticks, they would just get cooked. Okay. Alright, we're getting some... Getting somewhere, people. We are getting somewhere, so let's put some more of this in here. Right, we've already gone through three planks. There's no way we're getting 20. I don't know why that said 20. I'm not really sure what that means. Okay. Oh crap! I already drank two water. I'm supposed to pay attention to how many water I get, and I let's remember I drank two, okay? Because I'm supposed to pay attention to how many, how much water I get, and I already used two, like an idiot. All right. Anyway, 15 scrap metal, 20 sticks, 20 rope. 15 scrap metal. Oh boy, not even close. Not even close. Nope, 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 nope. How many sticks do I have? All right. How many sticks do I have? Uh, oh, I got a lot of sticks. Okay, let's just get the scrap metal. Let's go get some scrap metal, people. Got a few minutes left on this video. I'm going to go get some scrap metal. And I would really like to upgrade my axe. What do we got here? What is that? Oh, that's the shadow, man. The shadow always throws me off. By the way, you, you get scrap metal when you eat those uh, rations of food, which is pretty cool. Makes sense. Oh, here we go. This, is, this should give us metal. This is going to give us metal and planks, right? Planks planks see that's gonna take too long for scrap metal though no no i'm gonna go look for something else that's gonna take too long all right guys i found a couple barrels and we now have i think just enough scrap iron by the way i know i didn't make the buoy um i gotta make sure i make the buoy before i leave here to explore anything else though um so i have to remember that i mean i don't have to i can always find this place but um it would just be so much easier with a buoy so let's get back here. We're gonna we're running out of time here. Like I said before, I'm gonna try and keep these episodes around 20 minutes, um, since the content in this game is light. Uh, so we are just about out of time here. You know what, guys? I think we're gonna upgrade the axe. I don't think we're gonna use it. So you gotta come back next time. Ha! <laughs> Cliffhanger! Axe 
Axe cliffhanger! <laughs> God. Alright, so let's go ahead and grab that. That should be just enough. What else do we need for it? Um, 20 sticks and the rope. 20 sticks. There we go. Upgrade! By the way, um, I like the, I like the uh, upgrades going the other way. You see how the knife is white and the other ones are like kind of like a, a darkish color? I think it should be the other way. I think you should start off with the darkish color and then upgrade to the other ones. Because those knife look, the knife looks like it should be a higher grade uh, because it's white. And white is higher grade than that like stone look, right? I don't know. Maybe that's just me. Anyway, guys, uh, let's check out really quickly. Okay, so we got the five fish. Uh, we could stop, right? Okay, so this thing will continue running. So for five fish, I used two planks, or three planks, possibly two. I don't know. It might have burned some planks unnecessarily. So, and that doubled the hunger you get from the fish. All right, now let's take a look at the water. So if you're going to cook five fish, I would put in two planks and see where it goes. You know? All right, so for here, okay, so we got uh, nine, ten, eleven. So we got eleven water from, I'm going to start keeping these here. Keep that. I'm going to keep the water there. The food isn't really as big of an issue. There we go. Uh, and I'm not going to keep my health packs there because we can't make health packs and I don't want to use them by accident. Anyway, um, five, 10, 10 wood for 11 water, basically. So pretty much one one wood plank per water. Yeah, it's not too bad. It's not too bad. All right, guys. The update saved the Let's Play. It really did because I had nothing left to do. Um, now I've got at least another week of videos. I got a lot of stuff I want to do here. I'm going to start building. Um, we now have a food and water source we can start building. This is going to be awesome. The harvesting has gotten quicker as it needed to because the harvesting was way too slow um, before this. The reason I like Raft better than this game is Raft has a much more interesting way of gathering materials and you can eventually automate it, which makes it even better, okay? But this game rec recognized that and it's starting to up the resource gathering. We can upgrade our tools, which will make the resource gathering even, even faster. So I'm really enjoying this game. I'm enjoying it quite a bit. I'm glad the Let's Play is not going to be over. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. I will see you next time. And until then, take it easy.